Alright, so, um... I've had a delivery. <laughs> and this is a little bit light, but we're gonna be opening it today. And yeah, let's get right into it and I'll show you guys what exactly it is. Here it is. God, this thing is huge. Charizard UPC. Yes, I am a little bit late to this, but gonna be opening it today because it is long overdue and I meant to open this when it first arrived. But yeah, here it is. The Sword and Shield Ultra Premium Collection for Charizard in all its glory. It's giant. <laughs> Look at this thing. Oh my, here we are. Oh, please just work. There we go. Finally got it out. Here's a little you know, corner piece that it comes with. Promo cards right there. You get the dice and all of that. So yeah, it'll be pretty sick. I don't even know how to open one of these. I won't lie to you. I have never opened one before, so this is gonna be a bit of a... Ah, oh, it does. It's like magnets, which is pretty sick. Oh my goodness. Some difficulties. Jesus Christ, this thing is huge. So we got that out. So there's... You know, the little drawers and everything. Oh, there's like a little book up here. Hang on. Come here. Ah, oh, this is probably just like that checklist thing that they give you. Yeah, so it just kind of like goes through the sets and stuff like that. Pretty standard stuff. Really nice artwork though. I like the coloring. I'm assuming that this is the playmat that it comes with. If I can open it. Here we go. Is. We'll slide that one off. This one up. Holy crap. It's literally too big to even fit in the screen. But look at that. That is sick. Honestly, this might become my new mouse pad. Look at that artwork. Holy. I think it's going to become my new mouse pad. Okay, and then we got our little drawers in here. So. Okay, here is some packs and everything like that. Oh, and we have, we've got the promo cards in here, which is sick. Look at the artwork on that first one. All right, we'll open that in a little bit. Then we've got some packs. We've got Lost Origin, two of them, two, three Astral Radiance and three Brilliant Stars in that one. I think we'll open those in that order, actually. I'm gonna pop those to the side and pop this one back in. We'll just go through the box as it is. Okay, so here we've got some more packs. Up. The boxes are actually like really cute. They're kind of decently made. So we got Fusion Strike here. We got three of those. Oh, okay. So we've got our coin. That thing is nuts. Look at that. The Golden Charizard coin. That's sick. That is actually really cool. I do collect some coins and things like that. And then we got the V Star marker. So nothing extraordinarily crazy. Then we've got three Evolving Skies and two Vivid Voltage and a Darkness of Blaze. Alright, that's pretty sick. I think we'll add those ones on top of there. And then finally, we've got our last little drawer here. Okay. Yep, so this is, you know... Oh my god, these are heavy. I got no idea what these are. And then we've also got the Poison and... Thinger. <laughs> I don't actually play the card game, I just collect the cards. Don't hurt me, please. And then, of course, we've got the sleeves, which are absolutely sick. I think I'll use these to sleeve up the cards. They're so cool, look at that. So here we have the promo card. So I'm gonna go ahead and get these out of here. Wow, holy crap, look at these. Look at the artwork on that thing. That's gorgeous. All right, I'm going to be very gentle with these. Oh my god. Look at this. It's actually like insane. I cannot get over it. And then finally, we've got the last one here, which is just absolutely gorgeous as well. Look at the details. I cannot get over that. That's incredible. And then we got the code card. A new sleeves out and we'll pop them straight into the... Oh, I think these ones are matte. Are they matte? 
Oh no, they're matte. All right, well, we're not gonna use the new sleeves because of that. You see how it's got... It takes away all the shine. You can't appreciate the cards properly. All right, we're just gonna use the regular sleeves that I use. We're gonna pop them in very carefully. They're actually gorgeous. I cannot get over them. This is why everyone buys these boxes. This is why the price point is what it is. Because, like, look at that. They're absolutely insane. However, because they're all in one sleeve, it's really difficult for them to be in really good condition. Mine are all right, though. The centering is a bit off and everything like that. But they don't look too banged up, which is good because I would be incredibly sad if they were, like, completely mangled. But, like, look at that. They don't look too rough. The corner up here, I don't know if you can see that. It's a bit messed up, but you know. Nothing overly horrible so far, but this one looks all right. But yeah, we're just gonna pop them at the back and um, we're gonna go through this absolutely massive stack. Like, dude, look at this. How many even is there? Just finished organizing them. So we've got the Fusion Strike first, then we're gonna do Vivid Voltage, Astral Radiance, Lost Origin, Darkness Ablaze, Evolving Skies, and then finally Brilliant Stars. And we've got an absolute stack here to go through. Look at that. Look at this. That is actually ridiculous. We're just gonna leave it in a little big pile over here. Let's start opening it with Fusion Strike. All right, we've got Fire Energy, Darkrai with a cool artwork, Croconaw, Elise's Sparkle, Tynamo, Zorua, Shelda, Caterpie, Drilba, Adventurous Discovery as our reverse, and a regular rare Kangaskhan to finish that one off. Nothing in the first pack, but that's fine. We've still got literally everything to go. It's, it's insane. I'm not really expecting anything from these because with most collection boxes and things like that, you don't usually get many good pulls from them. Like, I feel like they kind of just, you're paying for the promo cards that you get and then that's it. And you kind of just get stuffed over. You might get one nice pull, but usually it's just like a V or a V Max. Someone got a secret rare or something like that, but it's usually not one that you're gonna get, unfortunately, but you know, like I said, you're paying the money you are for the promos, not the packs inside. But you do get to open up a bunch of them, which is part of the fun, so that's always good, you know? Because that's the fun. Even if you don't get anything, you get to have a look at all the cool artworks and everything like that. And it's not like they're ugly. Like, look at this. That is sick artwork. Toxel, Totodile, Baneri, Clubopus. Jesus, what a name. Vulpix as our reverse and Verizon as our regular rare. So nothing out of the Fusion Strike, but that's all right. Because there's not really anything in Fusion Strike that you really want, if we're being honest. All right, onto the Vivid Voltage packs. And I I think I'm just going to go through these really quickly because, like, there's so many packs that you kind of just got to rush through them a little bit. So let's try not to dwell on any of these unless we get, like, an amazing hit. I'm not really expecting anything, though, like I said before. But, you know, you got some cool cards in here, so... And plus, like, I collect them to fill out my binders, and that is exactly what we're doing. I might not have collected many of the older sets. Evolving Skies and Brilliant Stars are the sets that I've been, like, you know, trying to complete a binder. Obviously, that's going to be really difficult to do, but, you know. Uh, Galvantula, Go Goat, Electrike, Pineco. What is that? Mudbray. That's actually really cute. I don't think I've seen that one before. Pucciana, Charmander, Reverse is a Wind on Stadium, and oh, we got a Alakazam Full Art. Well, I think that's going to be the only card that we get today. That is sick. Look at that. That is actually really nice. Oh my goodness. Let me just grab a sleeve. I don't have this card, so that's really nice. We got a Full Art. That's sick. That's better than anything that I was expecting, if I'm being honest. Like I said, I was kind of just expecting to get like a V or a V Max as the only hit. So having a full art is pretty cool. Astral Radiance is up next. We do have three of these. So, you know, it's one of the newer sets. Although Pokemon loves to be releasing sets as if there is nothing else to do in the world. It makes it very difficult to keep up with what the hell is new and what isn't. <laughs> and I'm like, which one is the newest set? Because there's just so many of them. Like, I swear, Astral Radiance only just came out, and now there's, like, two more sets. 
I cannot keep up with this. I have other things to be doing. It's very difficult. <laughs> yeah, I haven't really been doing much to do with Pokemon. I did pre-order like V-Star Universe. I got like two boxes of it that I pre-ordered. But um, the shop that I pre-ordered through, like the website went down and the whole shop is like shutting down or something like that. So Loki just like lost a lot of money. So I really wanted to collect that set because it's literally insane. Uh, Golduck, Super Effective Glasses, Cricketoon, Hisuian Quillfish, Cyndaquil, Hisuian Quillfish, another one, Hisuian Growlithe, oh my god, Bergmite, Unidentified Fossil, and a Reggie Drago as our final rare for Astral Radiance. We've got two Lost Origin packs here. Like, is this not the most recent set? No, Silver Tempest is. But this was the most recent set when this box released, I think if I remember when this box released, which I don't really, but I'm sure all of you have, you know, seen the videos and, you know, seen what's in the box. Maybe you guys have some yourself. I don't know. I do have, whoa. Okay. We got a Snorlax trainer gallery. Look at that. Oh, that's sick. I don't think I have that one. And then yeah, just a regular, check that one out. Oh, that's sick. I don't have Snorlax's character uh, trainer gallery. I don't have his trainer gallery. So that's really cool. I'm going to pop him up the back. Sorry, I'm covering up the, the promo cards. The reason this box costs so much. Alrighty. This is the last one of Lost Origins. Oh, how many is that for? Okay. There you go. Fighting Energy, Surviper. Galarian Stunfisk looks kind of funny. Bronzong, Mindfu, Litwick, Snova, Snova, Rhyhorn, Apom, Reverse Beautifly, and we have a Hollow Zoroak. I actually, oh, I dropped the card. Glad it wasn't a full art. I actually really like this artwork. Oh, look at that, it will focus. That's actually really sick. I like that. All right, so we have one Darkness Ablaze, obviously, because it's a Charizard box. I'm kind of surprised that there is only one, though, because, like, the box is meant to be, you know, Charizard. So, you know. I don't know. I feel like there should have been more that were aimed for Charizard, but apparently not. However, one of the Darkness Ablaze is really cool. Check out that artwork. That's really pretty. Electric, Mr. Mime. What the hell? R Rookity. Alright, never would have <laughs> pronounced that one correctly. Tauros, Reverse Rookity, and a Staraptor as a regular rare. Come on, Charizard! You're meant to be, you know, the whole thing of the box. You just got absolutely ripped off by him. We're up to the final six packs. Holy crap, we burnt through that really quick. Should we do alternating? No, let's just do it in a big hit. All right, Evolving Skies, come on, give me some of those evolutions, please. I'm begging, man. I really want some of them. They are the coolest looking cards ever, but you know, we'll see what we get. Full Face Guard, Ice Q, don't know how to say it, Pikachu, <laughs> Flabibi, Slackoth, C Dot, Reverse Wobbuffet, and oh no! No! Oh, guys! We got a Garbodor VMAX <laughs> out of... Oh, man. You know what? I'll take it. I just... Why couldn't you have been one of the Eevee evolutions? We literally got garbage. <laughs> oh. oh, man. Let's pop him at the back. I cannot believe that. That is the saddest thing ever, but it's okay. Oh man, okay. Let's save Umbreon for last and hope that Umbreon pulls through. Got my hopes up, man. I saw some shine and I was like, oh, this is going to be it. It's going to be one of them. And then we got Garbodor. I cannot believe that. Oh man. I don't think we're going to get much else, if I'm being honest. Oh, Slackoth, C Dot, Reverse Lotad, and oh, we did get a Hollow though. Hollow Dialga. That's all right. That's all right. Not too bad. Not too bad. Umbreon, please, please, please pull through. Come on. All right. One, two, three, four. Are they upside down? They were. All right. Let's go. Ooh, psychic energy. Scroll of the dragon thing. Herdia. <laughs> Golduck. Kavana. Flabibi. 
Slackoth. We're getting a lot of Slackoth and C-Dots, I won't lie. Love Disc, Reverse Elemental Badge, and oh, we do have something. We got a Leafy on V. That is alright. Probably one of my more favorite evolutions. I prefer Umbreon and Sylveon, but Leafeon is definitely up there. They're all kind of equal in my opinion. Gorgeous artwork right there. Look at that. A little bit, a little bit scuffed on top, but she's all right. Have a look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Wow, we're actually getting a lot more than I thought that we would from this, if I'm being honest. I did not expect to get much at all. And once I got that full art, bro, after the Alakazam, I was just like, we are not getting anything else out of this box. There is no way. But yep, onto the Brilliant Stars. The last three packs of this video. Let's see what we can get. Ultra Ball, Hitman Top, Burmy, Staryu, Carablast, Clefairy, Cherubi, Fracture Reverse, and a Hollow Professor's Research. Okay, we're not scabbing out on the hollows, which is good. All right, onto the second last pack. Do you reckon we'll get some last pack magic? Look, I didn't even realize we left bloody Charizard to last. That's got to be something good, surely. Surely. Charizard, you're going to pull through. But let's get through this one first. Water Energy, Kindler, Prinplop, Sharon's Care, Nosepass, Snowrunt, Clink, Dedenny, Cubchoo, Starly Reverse, and a Warmer Dam regular rare. Oh. All right, guys, the final pack, Charizard. Can you pull through for us? Come on, let's see what we get. Oh, we just absolutely destroyed the pack. Maybe that means it's hiding something real good for us. Upside down again, oh my goodness. One, two, three, four. Oh, oh. I don't know if I saw something. I don't know, let's not get our hopes up. Weevil, Dusclops. Morgrim, Sork, Corfish, Golet, Chimeko, Chimcha, Reverse, Minchino. We do have something. Oh no. It's all right. A VMAX is still really good. I just happen to have this card already. A Kingler VMAX. Check that one out. Well, we definitely did have some last pack magic, which is really good. Check this one out. Look at that. Wow. All right. I feel like we definitely got quite a bit from those packs. I'm feeling very lucky after that. I won't lie. Oh my God. All right. Recap time. We got a Snorlax um, trainer gallery. Then we got our Leafy on V. Very beautiful card. Garbodor V Max, which is a little unfortunate. Kingler V Max. Oh my god, just getting two VMAXs, a V and a Trainer Gallery, and a Alakazam Full Art. Dude, I am so lucky. I have seen people get literally nothing out of these boxes. I'm so lucky right now. Check that out. And then of course, we have the promo cards that everyone is buying these for. Let's get another close look at this. Absolutely beautiful artwork. Charizard VMAX right here. Look at it absolutely beautiful and then the final charizard v star look at that absolutely gorgeous but yeah this was the charizard upc opening um if you enjoyed hit the like button and if you want to see some more pokemon stuff also hit the like button and maybe leave a comment on which is your favorite pull if you'd like but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys again next time. Peace out. Bye bye